Hi guys, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. I am so excited to finally open this. I woke up high energy today, if you cannot tell. Now that we're done with Vlogmas, I feel so... I don't know how to explain it, but I still want to do Christmas stuff. So I think that I'm gonna continue for New Year's. Of course, it's not gonna be Vlogmas, but it's still gonna be like very holiday-ish and cozy. I've been loving so much Vlogmas this year. I hope that you guys liked it too. I am so excited to finally film this. I love what I got for Christmas videos. That and organizing closets and stuff like that. It's like my comfort vlogmas, of course, too. I wish that I could do daily vlogmas. I would need to hire an editor to do that. So for now, once a week. <laughs> so let's get to the gift part. I know that you're here for that. There's one, no, two that I already opened. One of them is polos and the other one, you saw it on a vlogmas, but I want to start with the ones that I did not pick. And believe me, I was so tempted to open the ones that I ordered from Redelux. Them being wrapped up and under the tree was the best for me because I cannot pick, I cannot open them. I cannot like start using them or anything. I wanted for me to sit down and film this video because I have not seen the bag. The color, I am so curious about it, even though I know that I like it. So I don't know which one to start with, the Chanel or the Hermes one. I think we're gonna start with the Chanel one. Okay, so this and this are from Redelux. If you have watched my channel for a while, you definitely know who they are. They had this, it's gonna make a lot of sense, and that one probably too. The packaging is the most beautiful thing. Like, the paper has handbags. Like, this is a Chanel classic flap. Even the new Chanel Kelly, it's right here. And this is absolutely one of the reasons why I love them so much. They always put so much care and thought into their packaging and make you feel really special when you're buying from them. And to me, that I love wrapping presents and I love Christmas and I love all of that, this was amazing. So it's going to be painful to rip the paper, but we have to do it. So this year Christmas was a little bit different for us. We usually spend it with family and this year we just decided to stay home. I know, celebrate together. Pajamas, movies, champagne, you know. So I actually almost missed this on the website. When I saw them, I was already thinking about checking out on that one. Same shipping, same package. Why not? So let's rip the beautiful paper. I don't know what I would save the paper for. Hi, Masha. She does have two presents that I saved. She got more. She really likes opening stuff. Like she doesn't actually rip it, but she likes to see you opening it and then assuming what's inside is hers. So in case you didn't know, they also have shoes. It also has nice packaging inside. And here they are. These are going to be amazing to give my other ones a break because I've been abusing them. And when I saw they had them in my size, I just, I knew it. They are suede ballerinas in this like wine color. And I am 35, they had them in 35. So they are kind of a size up, but I can make them work. So this actually look amazing with my jumper. I just like ugly Christmas sweaters so much. This I'm gonna have to be quite careful with them because of course they're suede. With Chanel ballerinas, you have to be careful even with the leather ones, but these are stunning. My regular ballerinas, I got them. I was not sure if they're gonna be comfy and if they were gonna fit my style. With time I realized that I loved them. So I have a second pair and they are very different. Do you want to open one of your presents now? Okay, we can do that. I knew that this was going to happen. So here are Masha's presents. Okay, the second one, I'll save it for the rest of the video because we know that you're expecting more. Let's take the tag off. Do you like it? It's yours. These are absolutely going to attract a lot of Masha's hair. I don't care. I'm gonna be very careful with them. I think I'm gonna spray them, but let me show them in detail. They are absolutely beautiful and brand new and they fit me, so we know the rule. If I find shoes in my size, I get them. Now, this one is the one that I'm so excited to see. Something that I forgot to say is that I ordered these two like on a Tuesday and they arrived on a Thursday. So it was like a two-day shipping. Redelux is based in the US and I'm in Spain and it arrived in two days. No customs, no nothing because they cover the customs. So like they make it too easy which is dangerous, but amazing at the same time. I actually saw this bag. I've talked about it a few months ago. Of course, we're selling a bag to fund for this, but honestly, when you see what it is, you're gonna realize that it doesn't really matter. Thing is that with Hermes, sometimes the colors from camera to real life, they change a lot. And I care a lot about the color of this bag. And my prediction is that it's gonna be probably one of my most used bags of 2023. If we follow the prediction of last year, yeah, definitely. And they had two of this, but on the sale, I mean, I got one and someone got the other one. So I feel lucky that I was able to grab this one because this is a piece that you cannot buy at the stores anymore that I'll probably never see again. It has every aspect that I love. Are you joining me for the unboxing? She hears paper and she thinks, oh, it's for me. Of course it's for me. So now that I completely destroyed the paper, I'm making such a mess. 
So, are you ready? Let's do it. It comes with a little card, as always, the thank you for buying from us from Redelux. And in here it has the info of the bag. And this is the certificate of authenticity. So I'm gonna save that. Always good to keep it. Next year we're definitely doing what Masha got for Christmas because clearly she enjoys this quite a lot. Okay, so I'll just open it up. I'm gonna try not to break it slowly. I'm trying not to fold it here. It's so well packaged. I think she's done. Let's close this up. I think she just realized that it's a bag and not a toy. So this is it. And it has the orange dust bag, which means it's vintage. So it's a Kelly, a Kelly 25. I'm so excited. <laughs> and the color is amazing this is a kelly 25 box leather gold hardware it's vintage i need to go check on the date i'll put it on the screen because right now my brain is blank it's so beautiful let me do close-ups so here's the tag that we're absolutely going to remove oh my god this is beautiful it has this little pouch with the crochet and the straw and it also has the red lip sticker it's so so pretty let me just assemble it and let's take the tag off because it's not going anywhere so we're definitely keeping it wait the strap still has stickers so there's actually a little story with this bag box is my favorite Hermes leather and it's really hard to get it now at the store i've seen it here and there there are some people that get mini kelly's in box especially in black but something like this is so 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 hard to find and so hard to come by and it's in the 25 the color kind of reminds me of the inside of kinder chocolates or like this just very creamy beige i was a little bit concerned that it was going to compete with my mini kelly so i actually brought it to compare the colors and you can very much tell the difference and i think they're com completely different shades, completely different bags. And I know that many people are gonna tell me another white bag. No one questions someone when they get multiple black bags. I just find very easy to style white bags. I love them. That mini Kelly was the most used bag that I had from last year's. So this one, I am quite sure that next year I'm gonna use it so, so much because I do find times where this one doesn't fit enough and the Kelly 25, it's such an amazing size. I realized that I forgot to say the color of the bag. I am 100% going to mispronounce it, but it's parchment. And the first time that I actually saw this color was when I was researching a little bit for my first vintage Kelly Because as I said, I really wanted box leather And I've never seen one in person and I wanted to see how they would wear, how you can care for them, etc And I found this video on YouTube that I'm gonna link it in the description box down below in case you want to check it And she actually has the Kelly in box leather in the same color and I fell in love with the bag I never saw it again it's beautiful the condition is insane it has some stickers on that I want to remove but I'm so impressed with the color and how the bag looks it's beautiful I just want to give a massive thank you to Georgian Hunter for always 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 making my handbag dreams come true you're definitely gonna get to see this bag a lot next year I'm going to Paris in January and we know it's just coming I would love to know what you guys think about the color and the amazing Amazing, amazing condition that it has and being gold hardware I feel like it gives it a very different vibe than the mini Kelly I just know that I'm gonna love them both so so much and yeah I don't know I'm just so happy I'm gonna start using it right away not even gonna put it inside its dust bag of course when it comes to Hermes it has its certificate came full set as you saw amazing condition so I'm beyond happy my Christmas discount code is still active in case anyone wants to get anything from them as you saw they also have shoes and if they have my size they for sure may have your size they have access Accessories. I saw they had this navy Avalon pillow that I was also thinking about getting but from the packaging, the shipping, the customer service, the amazing content that they post on social media, I always enjoy watching the reels so so much. So yeah, I highly encourage everyone to check their website out. I have my monthly creation that I'm gonna leave in the description box down below but yeah. Now I have two other things that I want to open. Well, actually this one is already open and you already saw it, but I want to show it. So we made an early Christmas dinner with my friends and I ended up getting this. We know that I absolutely love Louis Vuitton SLGs, especially for makeup, skincare, or anything that you may want. But yeah, this I opened a while ago and I have been already using it. So it's not cheating because we did the gift giving beforehand. Sorry, I ran out of battery. Now Polo's here with us and Masha again. That actually, I think it's kind of time for our second gift here it is so shall we open this one she's not looking at me now she always does that like she gives you the back if she if she's not happy with you or you don't give her something so let's hope that with this one she forgives us i think she did like the chicken it's a chick or a chick no this is not a chicken so let's open this one this one is for you you want to help open 
I think no. This is. She's not happy. I don't know. She looks disappointed. I don't know why she doesn't look happy with it. Now let's go for Polo's gift. This one, I'm actually impressed because when we went to the store the other time to retrieve my love bracelet because we dropped it because it was effective, I got a new very, very nice essay and he gave me his card and I put the card inside the bag that I was wearing that day. So Pula went back to check on that video. Yeah, I went to, well, I had to remember which vlog was it. And it's funny because both of the watches that we wanted, they were really hard to find. So when we were looking for Polo's watch, I actually had to ask multiple essays in Madrid, not here in Barcelona to track one down from Paris because there were none available and I think you thought that you were gonna struggle more with mine too. It, I think it's one of the first times in a really long time that you actually surprised me. So I already opened it but I wanted to like put it back together to unbox it. I think you were very thoughtful for getting it for me because you know that I've been wanting it for such a long time. And now we're matching. I really like that here they have more packaging than back in Mexico. I feel like they... really nice. Yeah. They're always so nice at the store. They actually gave us a gift. So here it is. And it's a mini Panther watch in the titanium. And it's already fixed to my size. But it's so, so beautiful. I had on my wishes the mini, not the small. Because it just looks a little bit better on my arm. Yeah, because you have small... Hands and arms. <laughs> you make me feel like a T-Rex. <laughs> <laughs> so this is like birthday, Christmas and Valentine's Day. <laughs> Let me put it on. I've been wanting this watch for years now. Every time that we would go to the store, we try it on and now we finally have it. So this is how it looks like in the mini. And it also comes with a cleaning kit that I don't know if we got that with yours. Yeah, the cleaning kit and uh, like a travel pouch. Oh yeah, the travel. They have been giving us so many travel pouches in that boutique. No, and also because when I went to engrave mine, he gave us like two, two. <laughs> travel pouches. Yeah, comes with this lotion for jewelry watches and a little cloth to clean it. I wanted to start wearing it right away, so I don't think I'm gonna take it off. Just gonna stay there. And now we have matching watches. Now we have matching watches. And the last one that I don't know if you should drink it right now. This is actually from the SA. As I said, they're so nice in the boutique here. So they gave Polo this. I am very nosy, so of course I opened it. It's champagne. We should drink one right now. So we need to wait for them to be cold enough to drink. Oh, yeah. oh, it's actually Cartier Champagne. This looks like the tiny glass Coca-Colas, like the true Mexican mm, ones. Yeah. Do you think it's good? I hope that it is. We got two, so one each. We don't even need glasses. They're personal size. The blankets that I saw that they had were really, really nice. I've been actually thinking about skipping the, sh the Hermes one and going for the Cartier ones. I don't know no, which so one you like better. Like a set. I like better the Dior coffee sets. The one in Toilet de Juillet, it's really nice. The Mini Panther has been on my wish list for, I would say, around four or five years now. And the thing is that every time that I looked for the Titanium one, it was always sold out. So I'm actually shocked that he was able to find it. And it's definitely something that I'm going to use every single day forever, probably. You don't have to take it off when you shower. I need to go get it engraved, but I think you can't every single day. There's certain days on the store where the person who like works the machine to engrave your watches works. So I want to wait for the holidays to finish because I don't think that they're opening many days in the next few weeks. So there's no rush. He already opened his presents last night, but yeah, I'm gonna wait till rainy days are gone and start using this. I don't think that we're gonna have a lot of rain next week. This week, yes. It's been cold, cold. So I'm very grateful for heating. I feel like this year I got some crazy stuff, but also being very intentional in finding certain things that I know that are special. I cannot wait to see how I implement this into my day-to-day -day life. The fact that it's prettier than I actually expected just makes it 10 times better because I saw it on the website, it looked beautiful. Here, like, Box brings the color on the bags in such a way that Epsom cannot do it. Togo definitely makes the colors a little bit more dull, that it's perfect for certain pieces, don't get me wrong, but I have a very soft spot for box leather. This is going to be amazing. And I'm so grateful with Polo just for taking the time and looking for the card in all of my bags. We know that I have many bags with many pockets and organizers with more pockets. So I don't know how he did it without me realizing that he messed up the closet. He had to be quite careful with that. And yeah, I'm just 
thankful. I'm really excited about 2024 and all of the year has for us. And I'm definitely gonna keep vlogging for New Year's. I think that some of our friends are gonna come stay with us so we can go and party a little bit more. Sometimes I forget that we can still go party. I just feel so odd because everyone like in our age group still likes to go partying and clubbing and we're just very like, let's have some wine and drink cards type of people. We don't have anything planned yet, but something will come out and the vlog is gonna be interesting, I promise. But I hope that everyone had an amazing Christmas or holidays with your family or by yourself like us. There's also beauty in spending time, just the three of us with Masha together. I'll see you on the next video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I'll try to not forget to link the things that I say that I'm gonna link because I always do that. And if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing and click the notification bell down below so you don't miss any of my videos. And if you're not done watching, I'm gonna leave you two right here in case you wanna check them out. Thank you and see you on the next one. Bye! Bye.